So good to have the Twins back. So good to have Byron Buxton back. He absolutely obliterated this two-run home run. Wow, he also drew two walks in this game. That's as many as he had in all of last season. Uh, This did not go the Twins' way. It was ugly in the end. We'll get to that, but really nice to see Byron off to a good start. Miguel Sano saw 29 pitches uh, in this game. This was his uh, plate appearance in the first inning. Yes, he struck out three times, but uh, really uh, showing a lot of patience, drawing out some really long plate appearances. Also, Max Kepler had three hits in this game, uh, so some encouraging signs uh, from the offense. They did leave a lot of players, a lot of men on base, unfortunately. Did not take care of opportunities, but uh, looked good. Woodruff was nasty, and he looked pretty good against him. Josh Donaldson in the first inning, top of the first, pulls up with an apparent hamstring injury. No idea how long he's going to be out, but Arise had to come in from left to play third. Cave went out and played left. Uh, Just a, a tough blow to open the game. And then to end it, bad opening, bad end. Colome gets the first guy out, then hits the second batter, makes this play, really should have gone to first base to get the second out. And then this would have been the third out had Max Kepler caught that, and the inning would have been over. If they would have made those two plays, they didn't make either of those plays, and they paid for it. They had a a three-and-a-run lead entering the ninth inning, and Milwaukee completely erased that, took advantage of those mistakes by the Twins, and the Twins lose in extras. Uh, just a horrible day to spend opening day. Blah. But for more Twin Stock here on YouTube, please subscribe. This has been Tom Froming. Thanks for checking this out.